know Trey and Natalie, uh, through Natalie's father, Bob Dogler. Bob's one of my dearest friends. And I feel like I knew Natalie before I even met her. Because when Bob speaks about her often, and when he does, his eyes light up. Uh, he's so proud of her. Uh, and I first heard about Trey uh, when Bob told me, you know, Nat Natalie's dating somebody, it's getting pretty serious. And like, you know, friends want to know, I said, okay, do we like him? And Bob looked me dead in the eye and said, I like him. I like him a lot. And I like Trey too. Uh, although, first time I met Trey, he played a practical joke on me. So if you want to hear about that joke, catch me at the cocktail reception afterwards and I'll tell you the joke, but uh, he's a great guy. And Natalie, I completely understand why your father's so proud of you. You are, you are a joy. We're gathered together today uh, to witness and celebrate the marriage of Trey Cook and Natalie Gogler. We come together not to mark the start of a relationship, but to acknowledge and strengthen a bond that already exists. This ceremony is a public affirmation of the bond, and as their dearest family and friends, it is our honor and privilege to stand witness to this event. This day is made possible not only because of your love for each other, but through the grace and support of your family and friends. It is our hope that your fulfillment and joy in each other will increase with each passing year. Marriage is a commitment in life where two people can find and bring out the very best in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth, and no other human relationship can equal a physical and emotional joining that has a promise of a lifetime. Let us bow our heads in prayer, please. Lord, we thank you for gathering everyone here today. We ask that you help Trey and Natalie to remember the strong love that they share, to work that love into practical things so that nothing can divide them. May their love always inspire them to be kind in their words, considerate of the other's feelings, and concerned for the other's needs and wishes. Increase their faith and trust in you. Bless their marriage with peace and happiness, and make their love fruitful for your glory and their joy, both here and in eternity. Amen. While the commitment begins with the two of you, its effect radiates outward. It touches your family and friends and ultimately all of society. When this commitment is seriously made and continuously fulfilled, it leads to the richest and most rewarding of human relationships. Your relationship will take more than love. It will take trust to know, your, to know in your heart that you want only the best for each other. Dedication to stay open to one another, to learn and grow, even when it's difficult to do so, and faith to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for you both. While love is our natural state of being, these other qualities are not as easy to come by. They are not a destination, but a journey. Marriage is a give and take between two personalities, a, ming a mingling of two endowments which diminish neither but enhance both. Romans 12.10 says, be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. My next quote is, with my arms wide open, I threw away my pride. I'll sacrifice for you, dedicate my life for you. That's from Marvin Gaye and you're all I need to get by. You have already had so many roles in your life. Son, daughter, brother, sister, teammate, classmate, financial planner, marketing director. But now you're taking on will be one of the most important roles you will have, husband and wife. Seeing that no moment is without meaning, we ask that you take this marriage as the beginning of your lives together. Today signifies the creation of a new home and a new family for you both. May you be fulfilled by each other's love and friendship. May you be overjoyed by the promise you are about to make and the life together you will create. Remember that in every marriage, there are good times and bad, times of joy and times of sorrow. Marriage is a journey, a time of adventure and excitement. Enhanced by the love, trust, dedication, and faith you share in one another. May the promise you make to one another today be lived out to the end of your lives. Tomorrow can bring you the greatest of joys, but today is the day it all begins. Natalie and Trey, do you, with your family and friends as your witnesses, present yourselves willingly 
of your own accord to be joined in marriage? Will you promise to care for each other in the joys and sorrows of life, come what may, and to share the responsibility for growth and enrichment of your life together? Perfect. Having this love in your hearts, you have chosen to seal your vows by exchanging rings. From the earliest times, the circle has been a sign of completeness. The rings that you have chosen to wear have neither beginning nor end, much like your love for each other. They are a symbol of the words that you speak today. May these rings be from this day forward your most treasured adornment, and may the love they symbolize be your most precious possession. As you wear these rings, may they be constant reminders of these glad promises you are making today. Trey and Natalie, from this moment forward, you will never be alone. You will carry with you the love of another person, giving you a completeness and renewed lightness. May your life together be immersed in love and excitement. May you strive to enrich each other in every possible way. And may you work to bring the peace you find to this world. Having pledged their fidelity to one another, to love, honor, and cherish one another in the presence of this gathering and by the authority vested in me by the University of Alabama, Earl Todd, it is my honor to now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Drake.